Hey guys, welcome to the channel and I hope that you're enjoying uh, the content I've been putting out so far. Now, I'm going, I'm going to do something a bit different today. Um, I just received uh, this from eBay and I'm going to go through an unboxing with you. Uh, I tend to do a, a, a bit more shopping than I, I should. And I know that my wife is not too happy about it, and we that's always a cause of concern. But uh, yeah, that's something that I have an issue with, and I'm working on that. I'm really working on it. But today I got this, and I'm gonna open it up with you. I'm gonna unbox it, and I'm not sure what, what exactly it is. I think it may be a camera, and um, I'm actually I'm pretty sure it is a camera. Uh, so just a little experience here, just a short vlog here. This is a box that I'm going to unbox with you. And this is the Aqua I select camera. I always take these out of the cases. I really don't like my cameras in the cases for some reason. Because I think it kind of dates it. And um, so this is the Aqua Isolet One camera. And it came with uh, this thing, which I have no idea what this is. It says it's the roller cleaner. And then it also came with. Uh, with a manual, which is um, a small manual. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm gonna read it later. And I'm not just saying that, I'm actually gonna read it. So I think with this camera, um, I'm gonna clean it up nicely. So this is a medium format camera. It's uh, 120, it takes 120 film and um, now how do I open it? So the 120 film goes in the back here. It's pretty clean. The lens looks good. Apparently the, sh the shutter should work. So I'm going to test it to see if it works. Oh, look at that. Did you see that? Let's try it again. That was very, very satisfying. Look at that. Whew. That feels hefty. It feels very hefty how it opens up. And you can just see how the lens just pops up. And that is pretty nice. I'm going to bring it closer a bit so you can have a close-up view of this. That actually felt very nice. Um, this looks like it's in good shape here. I don't see any, any cuts or any holes in it. That's always a good sign. Um, the lens looks clear. Doesn't look like there's any uh, fungus or anything in there. Or oh, there's no oil on it, like residues on the on the shutter that I'm looking at right now. And what I'm gonna do is I'm I think I think how do I cock this thing? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Let's see. How do I fire this shutter? Hmm. Let's see. I know this is the. Oh, is that it? And, oh, there you go. See, I figured it out. 
you just push this down and then so let's see if the shutter is actually uh, moving yeah you will see the shutter actually uh, moving in there I'm not sure if you can see it maybe I'll move this back a bit and then you can see that it actually opens in there to let in the light so I think this is functional the shutter fires um, the winding mechanism rolls nicely um, it, it looks like this is uh, a fully functional camera from, from what I can tell and I can't wait to take it out for a spin to see uh, how it works I have some 120 film that I bought and I'm going to be taking these cameras my my medium format cameras out for a spin to, to test them out in, in the coming vlogs so please do tune in